welcome back to another one of my videos. So if you're a returning subscriber, thank you so much for coming back. And if you're new, welcome to my channel. So today I have three different booty blaster workouts. These are unweighted glute and hamstring primarily focused exercises that I do at the end of my upper body sessions. So I was inspired by Abby Carpenter. She's one of the girls that runs the Gains for Girls Instagram. So I definitely go check that out. And these are her words, is that the glute finishers enable me to put more volume and metabolic stress on my glutes without taxing my body CNS like having lifting does. This ensures that I'm maximizing my growth while still getting the recovery I need. And I really like this so that on the days I don't train legs or glutes with weights, I just use bands and do a circuit four to five exercises five to six times with 20 seconds max rest between each set. And this just allows me to target my glutes, different aspects of it, more frequently. And because the load isn't as high every day, I can recover them for, from them quite quickly. And especially right now, because I am eating in a surplus, it is definitely a lot easier for me. So I also read Brett Contreras' blog, and he was talking about how there's three types of exercises, stretchers, activators, and pumpers for your glutes. The stretchers cause a lot of muscle damage, Activators cause high muscle tension activity and pumpers cause a lot of metabolic stress, including a muscle pump. And some of these exercises can be done often while others can't. So obviously stretchers are probably more like your heavy squats and all that stuff. And so you're gonna be doing these a lot less frequently. However, so I do incorporate all three on a weekly basis into my workouts, but on upper body days, I have a tendency, tendency to do more of like the pumper type exercises, like the ones you can see in this video, because this is just giving my glutes a little activation, a little, I'm just targeting them a bit without having such a load on them that they can't recover from them. Um, and then I always recover enough then to do my heavy leg days as well. So as you can see in these workouts, I do a lot of sort of banded kickbacks, curtsy lunges, um, banded abductions, hip thrusts, frog pumps, body weight hamstring curls, because me, for me right now, obviously the hamstrings and the glutes are my primary focus. And sometimes I just add step ups in for a little sort of cardio aspect of it. So yeah, that's my workouts. I hope you enjoyed. These are ones that I've done. I did all three last week on different days. So hence the different outfits. Um, and yeah, so I hope you enjoyed the video and I also like to say that I know my form is not perfect in all of these but bear in mind that I was generally filming the last sets and uh, I did a full workout before so I was pretty tired um, and I do realize that my hands seem to touch my bum a lot and I just sometimes like to feel the muscle working which is probably why I'm doing that. So thanks again for watching and I've hoped you've learned something a little new and maybe you can start including these into your upper body days. So I hope you enjoyed this workout footage and I will catch you on the next video. Don't be afraid to comment below and let me know if there's any workouts you want to see. Ciao!